It is shopping crunch time, and if you still need help picking out toys this holiday season, we've got you covered. Top picks from who else but the kids. You just have to pick out a card. Right pick here. Pick out a card? Okay. Pick I already card. did that one. You did? Okay. Mm -hmm. These two cuties are doing more than just playing. They are toy testers. We're trying to match that card. The girls liked the Smarty Blocks, and so did a lot of other kids. In a toy test done at Goddard Schools Nationwide, it was voted as one of the top ten. Now for the Ogo Sport Disc. You play it using a koosh ball. Lily, are you ready? All right, let's do this. Woo! <laughs> How'd I do? It's crazy. It is crazy. That was fun, though. Good job. <laughs> Next up, gel crayons. They look pretty cool, but <laughs> these kids have been playing with them for just a little bit. And Cameron and Avery, let me see your fingers. Look at how messy they are. Even though it's messy, the gel crayons by Faber Castell and the Ogo Disc Mezzo by Ogo Sport were also on the top 10 list. Let's see it. Try your car's voice. Awesome. Yeah. I want to try my car. Hey, give me my yellow car. Hey. Lots of excitement over this toy, the giant roller ramps by Lakeshore Learning Material. Not only did the kids at the Goddard School in Centerville love it, but it was voted as the number one toy overall. The voting is done by kids with help from some teachers. Can you try to find me a circle? And you have so much time to do it too. Those little guys are actually grading it. They're doing a ballot. They're filling out. They're voting for what they feel is the best toy. We're utilizing our smart boards so that we can come up with, you know, a real objective process to be able to grade which toys they like the best. So these kids are kind of like elf consultants, helping Santa pick the perfect toy to put underneath the tree. And it was so much fun to hang with those kids and just play. <laughs> a cool job for them, toy testers. Now, I'm wondering why we didn't see any frozen toys in there. Well, because they're Explains. mostly educational <laughs> yeah. toys. Oh, okay. So the, the point is to play and learn at the same time. That 49 Goddard schools across the country took part in this, and they do have a top 10 list out. We will put that on our website for you.